Here's the last entry that I'm going to be reviewing today for this contest, and hopefully there will be more contests to come. But this particular vehicle is made by Myura, and what can I say? This thing is just stunning. It's got a little sat nav thing going on in here, fully animated interior, which is pretty awesome. Beautiful details on the texture work. And I read that he used it from another vehicle. Or other projects, anyways. But, uh, he's sort of a professional. And, I mean, he's the one that built this map. What does that tell you about him? I mean, he definitely knows what he's doing. So, for appearance on this thing, I definitely give it a 10 out of 10. I look at it, it's beautiful. He built this in five days. And he's gone through as much work as making the suspension. They're just simple little black bars. They might even just be the NB. Yeah, I think they are. But he's built like this little piece right here, the frame, the lights. Do the lights actually work? Even the working lights, that's cool. I mean, this thing looks awesome. He's even modeled, got the, showing the inside of the vehicle, which is really cool. So definitely a 10 out of 10 on that. perfect custom sounds for it. Now this isn't a 6x6 six six vehicle, so we're definitely going to take it off-road to check out the handling performance. Let's go this way, my favorite spot. It is definitely a little boggy. The key is some more power to get up to the higher gears. But that's kind of realistic for a military vehicle, though. Things that I've noticed over time. They're very powerful. Okay, we don't need roads where we're going. Block differentials? Yes, there is. Wow, this thing's just walking over that hill. That is awesome. Wow, look at that. It's even got this, like, suspension on the cap. Let's see if I can hit a bump so you can see it. Oh, that's really cool. Look at this thing. It's just crawling over everything. I love this thing. I'm just, like, speechless. Oh, I'm in neutral. Okay. Oh, jeez. Okay, let's change the camera here. So we can see just what we're dealing with. See how good the brakes are on this, baby. Wow, for a big old heavy vehicle, that is awesome. Oh jeez. Oh, that's what you get when you're trying to play with the camera. But it saved itself. <laughs> this thing is just really cool. So, I'd say for the uh, handling and performance, this definitely gets a 9 out of 10. I would say 10 out of 10, but the steering radius on this thing is definitely good, don't get me wrong, but I just kind of hit that bump over there because it couldn't turn tight enough. And, I don't know, I know it's a 6x6 vehicle, they're not supposed to turn that good. I feel like it could definitely do better. Oh jeez, save it, save it. Wow, there we go. This thing is f just awesome. So here's an example of turning radius. It does not do very good right there. I would not expect it to make it up this hill. Wow. Can we go up this? Wow, it's just a monster. Definitely a 9 out of 10 for that. Uh, quality. Definitely 9 out of 10 on quality. And there's no questions asked. This thing looks beautiful. I mean... 
It's got a detailed little body going on. I wish you would have meshed the suspension pieces. See, right there I had to back up because it's not turning tight enough. Yeah, he needed to mesh the suspension pieces. That would be a little bit better. That's why I give it a 9 out of 10. But for 5 days, this thing is insane. In realism. So, I'm guessing this is kind of a futuristic military vehicle. I kind of would hope in the future these things have more power. But, uh, because of a little bit of lack of power, I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. Because, I mean, once you get into the higher gears, it just doesn't want to go anymore. Wow. Look at that. This thing is just awesome. But I won't waste any more of your time watching me screw around in this thing. So that concludes all the judging for Dodge Chargers 5-day modeling slash building challenge thing. And uh, he plans to have more. So if you really like this stuff and you kind of want to compete next time, such as me, uh, be sure to check it out. I know there's going to be a novice class next time, or beginner kind of thing. Oh, come on, come on, come on. So there's going to be a beginner class for people like me, who... I've made some vehicles before, but nothing compared to this. I don't feel like I could compete with this and I'd have like a better chance of winning. So be sure to check it out. Everyone come join in on the fun. And the more people the merrier. Oh, oh, jeez. Oh, oh, oh. Can we flip it over? Yes! We have succeeded in killing it. Alright, so, yeah. This thing is really cool. All the... Uh, the contest entries were really nice. I'm proud of everybody. So, good job to Myura, Dodge Charger, Siren Dude 2011, David, and TDS Guy. These are all great entries. And I can't wait to see what you guys come up next. See ya.